difficult. All we talk about these days is the severe drought we're in, but Natasha, you say to really get an idea about drought conditions, you have to take a look at the history of drought. Yeah, so we're gonna go back in time about uh, 21 years, but first let's start with just the last year, just a last year comparison. You can really see a difference. Of course, there have been very few times where we've been completely without drought, but this is where we are right now. Take a look, you'll notice at least half of the United States is dealing with some level of drought. And you can see it's really the eastern half that is mostly out of drought. But then let's go back all the way to one year ago. One year ago, yeah, we were dealing with some drought, but we weren't seeing almost the entire state of Oregon in the severe drought category. So this is quite a drastic difference. As always, most of the West Coast, to some extent, is going to be seeing the worst of it, and we're certainly seeing that trend again this year. But let's go back a little bit further in time. Let's go back to 2000, the year 2000. And of course, keep in mind, these records go back much farther, but we just want to take a look at the most recent history to start. So what you'll notice is to start off at the year 2000, we were doing pretty good in terms of rainfall. In fact, we were seeing above normal rainfall. And then we had a couple of spikes where we had the severe drought category from the years 2002 to 2004. In fact, it was in the year 2004. That's when we saw the extreme drought category, but only for a small percentage of the state. And then it went away. We didn't see the extreme drought category for several years. In fact, we went all the way up until yeah, most recently, before we saw the extreme drought category again. So here's what's significant. Just notice in this recent history from 2012 all the way up to this point in time, look at the spaces in between the severe drought time periods. Very few time periods. We're talking about a matter of months, not years. That is significant when you're talking about above normal temperatures combined with those extreme drought categories. Now, if we take a look at what it looks like, remove all of the colors just so that you only see that severe drought category. This is the category we're seeing right now for almost 99% of the state of Oregon. Let's step back in time all the way back to 2001. You see the spaces? Yeah, so it's been our most recent history from 2014, 2015, up until this point where we've been seen more consistently that severe drought category. If you want to learn more about drought conditions, we see it every Thursday, we get an update, and also about our extreme temperatures from this summer, that being at the end of June. All you have to do is go to coin.com forward slash climate dash corner to learn more. So talking about our weather outside of the drought, 